Have you ever wondered what makes an art just an art or a realistic art? The realistic art will have a lot of richness in it and it will reflect all the fun that you put in to create it. So here are two important factors that makes an art a realistic one. The shadows and the highlights. Hi, my name is Ritika. I am an artist and a calligrapher from Tamil Nadu, India. I mostly do portraits with pencil shading techniques. I have also been taking client orders for almost 3 years now. So that's actually my favorite thing to do. I mean apart from teaching you. I will also love doing uh, color pencil realistic artworks and brush lettering. In this class, I am going to show you how to create a color pencil artwork with the help of other mediums. I have been comfortable doing pencil shading but I always struggle with color pencils on how to mix the right colors and how to create a realistic look. So I am going to teach you which I wish I knew when I started with it. Firstly, I will share in detail about all my favorite tools and supplies. Then we can jump on to the process of selecting a beautiful reference and later we will be working on how to use layering technique, how to pick the right colors for your reference, how to bring in the depth in a color pencil drawing using markers and the highlights using acrylic paints or gel pens. Another way you can utilize this skill is to apply it on your own style or apply these methods with other mediums that you work on. You can even experiment this with portraits. This class is a beginner friendly class. It is also great for side hustlers, freelancers or even hobbyists because you can learn right from basics. You can also learn the concept of realism to enhance your artworks even more. I started my art journey as a pencil shading artist which I love because you can recreate a realistic black and white photograph. A few years ago I also stepped in color pencil artwork because now I can create objects as we truly see them in real life. All the colors of reality. I'm so excited to share with you my tips of using mixed media with color pencils. I'm also eagerly waiting to see what you all create. So go ahead and watch the next video and I'll see you there.